Slamming, we're back, and we're going to uh, we'll start doing our episode three of Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus. Yep. So last time we went into the machine. This time, high we're on a high heist. class heist. Oh boy. So. There's a lot of fucking stuff. There's a lot of stuff. Except not really. Uh, you're not breaking all the vases on the wall. Yeah. Uh. Now, if I had uh, fewer lives and not a golden horseshoe, you could smash all this stuff, and it's worth, as you heard Bentley say, millions. Yeah. Millions. Right there. Yeah, all seven millions. But uh, I have enough lives, and I have enough stuff, so I'm not going to waste y'all's time, because y'all's time is precious. You've... Let me have this moment of your time, and I don't want to waste it for you. I want oh, you to enjoy it. I don't give a it. shit about wasting people's time. So we're going to go through. Now, if you remember something I said last time, there's a way to cheese the camera. And, oh, yeah, I forgot about this dude. Oh, you got to do this in one shot. Now I only have one chance. But since I am... I wonder who knows what I'm going to say next, since I am a master thief, I can do that. Yeah, you waste your... It's not a waste. I did that on purpose. You're a waste. Because now I can collect all these coins. Yeah. Because what kind of master thief doesn't take everything oh, in front of him? Oh, I just realized that those statues that you were breaking earlier were statues of Raleigh. Yep, they're all statues of Raleigh the Frog. He's very, uh... Frawley the Rog! Frawley the Rog. He's very, uh... What's Wait, the is word? That the... Egotistical. Yeah, the chest is right here. Oh, so you're gonna have to go back. I need more clues. Oh, yeah, they do play some of the, the chests early on the level, so there is a little mm -hmm. bit of backtracking every now and then. Which I guess is, like, um... One of the few faults of this game, I suppose. I wouldn't even call it too much of a fault. Yeah. Because there's some levels where they're, like, the vaults are actually hidden. Yeah. But this is the first area, so you gotta be nice and generous and not, uh, too mean to your... Well, it's, like, if it's hidden, people. you can hide it, like, at the end of the level, you know? But having it hidden through the rest of the level, it can be kind of annoying to be like, Oh, I found the vault, but now I'm gonna have to come back here. And especially on a level that's slightly longer. Yeah, it can be a little annoying. Sick, uh, thief skills. Still. Nah. Here's, uh, one of my favorite tricks from my childhood. Just, uh, I'm gonna leave you guys here. Just peace out. I'm gone. I'm going home. I don't need all. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm gone. Oh, that is great. Bye, fam. I can't. Bye, fam. I don't need none of y'all. And then, just, yeah. Welcome back. This is, uh, episode three. <laughs> This is episode three and a half, actually. Did I go too far? No, I'm too far. Yeah, you went a But I loved it. Just those small little quirks and stuff. Yeah, oh my god. See, look how fast he's going. Crazy fast. But none of these levels are too long. They get longer as we go on. As is the case with pretty much any game. What? The level's getting longer? Yeah. Probably harder? These guys will mess you up. But, if you mess them up first... What do you mean they'll mess you up? <laughs> they'll, uh, they'll, they'll sit on you. Yeah, but and not like, the good kind. Uh, you know, compared to the guys that fucking set you on fire, I mean, they're kind of... I mean, you, 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 you can pick your poison. Oh yeah, this place is cool, so you gotta... He's still gotta now use his uh, Master Thief skills, as he calls them, and constantly jump over these rotating lasers. It's, uh, quite the challenge. Because, oh boy, there's a... Oh wait, this one's fine. Now, anybody knows... Who knows anything about frogs is they love lily pads. But... Raleigh's biggest... F foe... Biggest friend has become his biggest foe. Because he has led me straight... To his master key. And you uh, don't really need to hold this, hold hold on to the circle here, but uh, you may as well use those master thief skills. Yeah, just because you are, you know, because that's that's what you are. You gotta rock what you got. Like you, do like that. Shit, dude. You just hide right through them. I thought you were fucked. Nah, I'm fine because you know what I am. 
an idiot, an asshole who says the same thing way too many times. Yes, exactly. <laughs> all right, I'm that one wiggles, so you gotta be careful. You gotta use all your uh, abilities right there. You can come back, yeah, hit that and then go back for it. No, not yet. Because uh, I know what's right here. What's right there? Oh shit, and then you have to go back for the fucking chest. Yes. So now we go back here. Oh, and ooh, bada bing, bada boom. Bada boom, bada bing, what a beautiful ting. As uh, my professor has said before. Which professor? Goodbye, world! Bada boom, bada bing. What a beautiful ting. Just jump down on one of those lily pads. That's what I tried to do and I died. Now I actually well, die. Well, if you die, you'll get there quicker. Never mind, you got that checkpoint. Yeah, I'll go right there. Oh my god, I love this game so much. I hate this game. He, he doesn't hate this game. This fucking... What, you're playing as a raccoon. Those things are dirty. Hey. They're infested with disease. Hey. They try to take food from cats. Hey. Hey. They just try and survive, man. Yeah. Because people like you. You know... People like me? What about people like me, Dill? Knew what they were doing. But Bentley knows better. Dude, I can't even count the six. But, uh, watch this. I'll totally put in the right code. Four, three, s uh oh! Uh oh! Nah, that's okay. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Glitches get stitches, let's go. These are the blueprints of Riley's entire operation. So like I was telling you about, now it's wired directly into my eyeballs. So I can see nearby clues and breakable yeah. objects. Your face eyes. So, I think I left one of the statues available. So if I look, those red things are breakables. The green ones are going to be where clues are. So when I go oh. into the next level, if I say, oh no, I can't find a clue, I'm so lost, where do I go? I can look through my Binocicom. I never used that shit, and I wasn't a whiny ass bitch. I just found the shit because of my own merit. I mean, but if you, if, if it, it's there. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> it's there for bitches. <laughs> it's okay. A master thief uses everything to them. And now since we smashed that alarm, we can just run through here. A master thief uses everything to them. All right. Oh, Dylan's gonna get a key. And that's that, y'all. Alright. Three keys down. I think there's one more key in this area. Right? Yeah, I think it's three for the first area. So, I think, you know, we got time for you to we do... We got time for one more. Oh. The next one ain't hard. And like I said, everything respawns, so there's no point in not doing this. Now, that guard doesn't respawn, because that'd be kind of unfair. Is it really three? No, it's three for this segment, and there's another segment after this, right? Yep. Almost every level is split in two. Is there one that? Or isn't? almost every overworld is split in two. Yeah. Because each uh, like area is like a you know a small hub area. Um, you know some of that open world action. Yep. That's what they call it. Now we gotta hide here, as any true master thief oh, that's an octopus knows. Man. Yeah, that's Cthulhu Hulu. Cut Hulu. Yep, so now we're going to use our cunning disguise to make it through Sir Raleigh the Frog's library. Oh yeah, I fucking love this level. Oh yeah, right there. This level's great. Uh. Oh, well. Have you ever been to well, a library? Well, no, you haven't played Slay 4, have you? Nope, I have not played Slay 4. Oh, uh, you're going to totally have to fucking play that. Now, watch this. Those rats got, Those rats got pegged. I'm going to enjoy this. Don't you get it, Sly? Don't you get it? I get it. Wait a second. Is anybody get across that without you know getting the? You have the a power up you get later in the game can help you, but even then it's hard as all hell. But if you jump in this right here, you you can actually do this, and then it still works fine. See? But uh, you can't do it a second time. 
So, uh, forewarning. What do you mean you can't do it a second time? If he burns it again, I think you just, uh, die. Oh, you can break the dartboards. Mm-hmm. So, fun fact, if you smash this clock right here, there's just tons of keys. Tons of coins. Don't know why it's that particular one. Is there any of the other clocks? Nope, that's the only one. Wow, so that's and that's the master key right there. What? Oh, a master key for a master thief, huh? If you guys haven't figured it out yet, I'm a master thief. More like a bastard thief. I never knew my father. Yeah, so this guy's so dumb, there wasn't a barrel there. But he comes back around. Oh, I guess it's okay. I mean, haven't you ever played Zelda Wind Waker? No. Oh. I don't have a Switch. What do you mean? Wind Waker was a GameCube game. It's a Breath of the Wild. I said Wind Waker. Never mind, I'm dumb. Mm. One thing you all will learn about me very fast. That's Dylan's funny. the stupidest man you'll ever meet. That's true. And then, aerial attack. Aerial attack. Actually, kind of. Aerial attacks for days. Hey, you jump on that. The uh, suitcase. Isn't there one aerial move, though? Yeah. You have to jump on that bookcase right there. Oh, yeah, I remember. I'm just testing you. You're just testing me? Just testing you. See, Master Thief. Could you get onto the other bookshelf from there and then, like, maybe run around the top for them? If you wanted to. I don't think that'd actually be fruitful to you, though, in the end. Nah. It'd be cool if they had something like that. Oh, oh guess what I forgot? My good old friend, Mr. Barrel. Why was it the barrel breaks? Uh, then I guess you gotta go. F oh, look at that! Whoop! You guess you gotta go what? Go fuck yourself? Yeah. There's another barrel somewhere in this level because you can't take this one somewhere. That was. Uh, you should jump out of it and get those clues up before you go to the carpet. And there's also something behind you. But uh, gotta deal with these booby traps first. Hey, you said booby. Movie. We're adults on this channel. Oh god, camera, why? And get that chest, uh, that. Mm hmm. So, is it here? No, that can totally go. Yeah. It's probably going to be after a platforming section where we have to get a new one. Mm hmm. I'm trying to remember how hard this level was the first time I played through it, because the first time I played through this game, oh boy. Oh, I mean, like. But who doesn't? Oh, yeah. But I don't know. And if we do this, oh, I wonder where the safe is. I wonder where it could be. You know. But I love this game is, I, this game is just I, I love it. It's so simplistic in nature. Yeah, he didn't see shit. He didn't <laughs> see so, shit. So good at this game. So simplistic in nature, but I love it. I mean... See those master... Oh, That's a boogie right there. That's a loogie. Oh, that, that, that tastes nasty. Whoop. Maybe I lied. Maybe you can't... Yeah. The barrel can't die. The barrel's forever your friend. Okay. And uh, as everybody who ever watched Scooby-Doo might know, bookshelves are more than meets the eye. What's Scooby-Doo? What's Scooby Doo? Doobie Scoo. Where are you going? Uh, to find secrets. We're going to Narnia, Matthew. I don't want to go to Narnia. They've got lions there. But the lion's technically Jesus. <laughs> A spoiler alert up! <laughs> if anybody hasn't read that book that's 12 years old. Oh, fuck no. <laughs> what do you mean 12 years old? I read it when I was 12 years old. <laughs> Go get that barrel. Let's get the fucking bit. Uh, as a true master thief would know, 
Uh, don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> that's a that's a master thief. Oh my god. Uh, don't do that. <laughs> All right. I thought this episode's not a disaster thief. <laughs> yep. Don't fall down either, because if you fall down, you're in trouble. Don't get that key. No, not yet. Where are those? How many? Well, that works. That works too, because now we can uh, speed run all the way back here, get some practice for our uh, master thief run. <laughs> Yeah, take that escalator. No, how many are you missing? None. I have all of them. Really? Yep. So you fall down was just... You fucking liar. Uh, Wait, check behind the case. And by none, I mean... This is what I'm talking about. It's not cheating if I have it. You just mean to suck at the game. Yeah, it's over here. Man, all the way back there. Oh. Oops. Yeah, you did it. I did it. I'm the greatest. Oh, Dell's so fucking good at this game. Now go I get, am the best. Go open that case and let's leave this level. I think once we leave this level... That'll be the end of an episode. Oh my god. Well, Doesn't matter. It's a speed run. Oh shit. I thought you were like actually dead and I was like nah. And Dylan's gonna be that's a fast track back, but no. I would have gone right there. Yeah. No no Dylan's not good enough to Yeah, definitely not good enough. Did I mention on the on the greatest of this game? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we can we can we can wrap this episode up. Yeah, I won't take done. much longer on this episode. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. To enter the vault code. With the help of a straight edge and compass, the answer was simple. Dial in two four two. Two four two. I can't count for two. <laughs> I can't count that high. I can't count. That's why Bentley's the brains. Outstanding. Another page from the previous Raccoonus. This one features. <laughs> You know, it's actually each one of these like clues they like fit together and make a picture. It yeah. says two four two. Yep. And like missing like one corner piece that has like nothing in it. He's like, I have no idea. I what can't figure it out, bro. I have no idea. Sly, help me. I need that last corner piece. So this move, theoretically, what move is it? The slow motion jump. Yeah, it can help you. Uh, this you know, be precise. theoretically helps you dodge the uh, bullets. Yeah, it's supposed to like help you be able to. You can't actually move quickly in it, well, because you're slowing down time. But you can be more precise with your movements, and especially your second jump. Yep. That's all. Oh, look at that! That's so sick! Hit it. Slow motion smash. And well, that's an episode. All right, guys. We'll see you guys here uh, next time. We're gonna go back to prowling the grounds. And we'll prowl the grounds. Once Peace again, uh, thanks for watching, and let us know what you think.